Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 uh, Where to Find an Outfit video. Uh, in today's video, we're going to take a look at the Blue Ridge Caravan outfit, how to get it. So let's stop wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so before I go into how to get it, uh, I'm going to quickly show it to you and then. Well, basically, how to get it is pretty simple. You just gotta go and do the riding shotgun event. Uh, we just completed it. I'm wearing the full trader outfit, as you can see. I already made the review for the gas mask. Uh, the outfit I got it myself. <laughs> so it's pretty cool. And but it took me a really long time. I usually don't get nothing good from the caravan, uh, from the sh riding shotgun. But this is how the outfit looks like, and it's actually really nice. I'm actually going to be wearing this one. I like the way it looks. Look at that. And it's without the backpack, by the way. It looks massive, big, so definitely worth the grind. But yeah, have in mind, it's not going to drop from the first time, so you might want to do that event a lot of times. Plus, if you do the event, you also get the uh, treasure notes that you can convert into gold bullion. So the event starts at this location right here, but you gotta. Oh, hold on a second. Let me put on my backpack so I can fast travel. So it starts right over here, but you gotta start it by yourself. So let me show you how to start it. So once you fast travel to the location, you will need to go to this good looking fella by the name Vinny Costa you will need to speak with him Welcome back. and start the event but we just did it so he ain't gonna uh, allow me to trigger it uh, quick tips here uh, once you start the caravan make sure that you protect all the Brahim and collect all four uh, blue boxes that give you it's an optional one because if you collect them all basically uh, you will um, get more rewards on well bigger rewards on top of everything else uh, in case you're, if you're missing on those boxes what I'll recommend you to do once you get to the boss fight he's like always on the second level and I think always using a minigun if I'm not mistaken you kill him don't push the button to open the gates uh, take that time to find all the blue boxes you need four of them right once you find them, then open the gate and continue. So that's the easiest way. Alright, Z Clan, this is where I'm going to be calling it the end for this video. So I hope you enjoyed and found it useful. And if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity once you're commenting uh, because YouTube triggers on the F bombs and nobody sees them, only I see them. And I read them, but I delete them. I can't react to those comments that are hidden. Uh, and I disapprove them, so I delete them. Have that in mind. If you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Saul from Ukraine, so hi from Ukraine. Feel free to join our Discord if you want to team up with us for the uh, gold farming events, Scourge Beast, and so on and so forth. Plus, play other games because this is not just Fallout 76. Z Clan is not just about Fallout 76. We play other games as well, such as uh, uh, Warzone uh, and Elder Scrolls Online. I'll just start it out and just to see whether I'm going to like the, uh, the game to continue playing. So, this is pretty much it. Y'all have a good morning, day, and night, whatever you guys lock it at. And I'll see you in the next video. I gotta go keep grinding that gold and farm the double XP because uh, we got the double XP on the 14th until 18th of May 2020. Alright, folks, I'll see y'all later. Bye bye. From the ashes we rose into the future we'll go. We are Z Clan, we have a gamer's soul. Stop.